Today's video is on Magnetic Resonance Imaging, MRI. MRI is a medical imaging technique that uses magnetic fields, radio waves, and field gradients to produce images of the body's internal structures. Unlike computed tomography, CT, magnetic resonance imaging does not expose the patient to ionizing radiation. This imaging technique is also called Nuclear Magnetic Resonance Imaging, NMRI, and Magnetic Resonance Tomography, MRT. MRI is often used for the following purposes. Looking at the brain and the brain stem to investigate neurological cancers, abnormalities, and disorders. Looking at the heart and other parts of the cardiovascular system. This practice is known as cardiovascular MRI. Measuring flow velocities of blood throughout the body can be done with phase contrast MRI. Looking at arteries to identify stenosis or aneurysms. This practice is known as magnetic resonance angiography. Looking at structures within the musculoskeletal system, such as the spine, joints, and soft tissue tumors. Looking at the liver, pancreas, bile ducts, and the gastrointestinal tract. Staging and follow-up imaging of rectal and prostate cancer, and diagnosing, staging, and follow-up imaging of other tumors. Guiding instruments in three dimensions during minimally invasive interventional procedures. This practice is known as interventional MRI guiding the application of high-intensity focused ultrasound to ablate disease tissue. This practice is known as magnetic resonance guided focused ultrasound. Imaging while performing surgery to guide and confirm the success of the procedure. This practice is known as intraoperative MRI. Measuring brain activity. This practice is known as functional MRI. Measuring the diffusion of water molecules to diagnose conditions such as stroke and urological disorders such as multiple sclerosis. This practice is known as diffusion-weighted MRI. Measuring levels of metabolites to diagnose metabolic disorders, particularly those in the brain. This practice is known as magnetic resonance spectroscopy. Visualizing the cellular function of molecular processes using biomarkers for the diagnosis of cancer as well as neurological and cardiovascular diseases. MRI relies on nuclear magnetic resonance, a phenomenon in which nuclei in a magnetic field absorb and re-emit electromagnetic radiation. A typical MRI system consists of the following main components. Magnet. This creates a powerful and uniform magnetic field which points straight through the bore. Patient. The patient's body consists largely of water. The magnetic field causes the hydrogen protons in the water to polarize and point toward either the patient's head or feet. Pairs of protons pointing in opposite directions cancel each other out, while a much smaller number of unmatched protons do not. Radio frequency coil. This applies an intense pulse of radio frequency energy, which causes the unmatched protons to spin at a specific frequency and in a certain direction. Once the pulse is turned off, the hydrogen protons slowly realign within the magnetic field. As they do, the protons re-emit the energy that they absorb from the pulse and this signal is detected by the same radio frequency coil. Gradient coils. These magnets are switched on and off rapidly in a controlled sequence to locally perturb the main magnetic field. This enables spatial encoding of the signal such that thin slices can be imaged in any orientation and any location within the body. Processor. This utilizes a Fourier transform to convert the complex time domain signal into a frequency domain signal and ultimately produce 2D and 3D images. Table. This is what the patient lays on. MRI can be performed with contrast agents which affect the relaxation times of atoms. The most common radio contrast agents are gadolinium based. Some of the main companies who make MRI systems include GE, Siemens, Philips, Toshiba, and Hitachi. GE Cigna Pioneer 70 centimeter MRI system. Philips Ingenia 3.0 Tesla CX MRI system. Siemens Magnetom Skyra MRI system. Siemens Biograph MMR MRI and PET system. And the Hitachi Oasis Open Bore MRI system. Thank you.